everyone. Welcome back to JMC Creates. My name is Jackie McKissick and today we're going to make this card. Uh, wait, I get my foot still. There we go. Uh, so, I saw this card on Dawn Stump and Thoughts and I have just rejigged my sizes slightly. Um, what do you do? You open the ribbons. Not very often I use ribbon in my car, so I thought it would be a nice one for a change. You open the ribbon and send in a hug. Hugs. Ah. And then you open it up again to write your message. Sending love to you. Okay? So that's that one. Let's just tie up our ribbons again. While we can, while we can remember, there we go, and then this one says time to celebrate, and then it says hi birthday wishes, ah oh, look I've got a big dirty bit on there, emergency recovery we need it. And then it says, Happy Birthday Inside. So, I set my ink pad down the wrong way, and I seem to have gotten ink everywhere. Every blink and where possible. Right, I need a piece of that orange card. So, a piece that is three and a half by three and a half and put that in to cover up our messy crafting oh it should have been three and a quarter by three and a quarter oops three and a quarter by three and a quarter that's fair yes that's more like it there we go and these stamps I used I know that that is a, an old magazine stamp set um, and the wee dog ones I use, I actually got from Crafting with Gertie's seal. That's these little dogs. It was actually Dee Dee's crafts I got that one off. They are both on YouTube. Let's... Let's try and get this sunny side up. There we go. So those are our two cards. And I'm doing this one today while it is still fresh in my memory because I keep forgetting about the ribbon. I keep forgetting and putting it, the ribbon in. I have other videos ready to be made other projects sitting ready to be made but I'm doing this one while it's still in my head so I've gone ahead and scored a piece of ten and a quarter by five and three quarters okay you score at four and one eighth and then eight and a quarter okay that's your main then you need a piece that is seven by three and a half and you score at three and a half. Okay? So for our mats and layers, you need two car solid cardstock mats that are four by five and five eights. You need one you need, I'll just go through, you need two solid cardstock mats that are three and a quarter by three and a quarter. 
and you need one solid cardstock mat that is five and three quarters by one and three quarters five and three quarters your solid cardstock mats these are five and three quarters by one and three quarters two large ones that are four by five and five and two squares that are three and a half by three and a half then for your mats or your layers you need two paper layers that are three and a quarter by three and a quarter you need one paper layer that is five three eighths by three and three quarters you need one white layer that's five and three eighths by three and three quarters and you need one paper strip that is five and three quarters by one and a half okay so what you want to do is you need your small bit to that side okay and then you glue you glue that bit on there you also I forgot to say you also need a length of ribbon just cut it whatever length you want and it needs to go on this bit it needs to go on here first and it needs to go on the other one first if one can find the end yeah where's my scissors right so basically your your little card is going to go on top like that so you want your ribbons roughly there okay and then you want a bit that goes on the small card in the same way guess where it's going on and it's going to match up about there like that okay so that's for your ribbon so one piece on there and this is just some ribbon that I got in a positively paper craft kit I don't really use ribbon on my um, cards much anymore so it was nice to be able to get a bit of it I have a drawer full of it so it was nice to be able to use it up right this one is going on there then okay Like that. That one's going on there. Then that one will come over like that. And that will go on there. Like that. So. We will put on our mats first. one on the top make sure your candles are going the right way oh them candles are upside down Woo. that was close let's put them candles the right way up like that and then these candles need to go that's the right way up there like that okay we'll be straighten them up a bit 
there and then this one's going to go inside as well and then we will consider gluing that on okay so you want this bit to go on there like that so from there to there okay put your little card on The ribbons don't have to be exactly the right height, but as long as they're able to be tied together. Right, so we'll let that harden up, and on this piece here, we're going to use, this is uh, an AliExpress stamp set. And we are going to put that and here and do our happy birthday like that right we need an ink we need an ink Of an ink that would go with that. Right, we're going for tempting turquoise because it was handy. Okay, so let's clean that off. Like that. There we go. That will do. So, let's clean that one off. And put it away so it doesn't get lost. Right, that one's ready to go in there. And it's going to go in the centre bit. So, I'm allowed to craft today. I haven't been allowed to craft for a couple of days because I fell down the stairs. What day is it? The 9th of March. I fell down the stairs a couple of days ago. So, I have to take it easy so I did. I think there's a dirty mark in my hand somewhere. So that's that. That's the main bits done. Now I've coloured another couple of wee stamps. 
and I'm just putting them on one on there and then another one on the inside okay and then I'm taking this dump set it's an old paper craft inspirations June 18 <laughs> okay and I stamped wish big which is going on the inside and I've used a one and an eighth for the white layer and a one and a quarter punch for the bigger layer and I've also stamped sending love on your birthday and I've used the one and three eighths punch for the white layer and one and a half for the map, the solid cardstock layer. So that's basically our little card. Do you open it up? Yeah, oh, that's so pretty. And then you open it up again and write your message. And we have no problem standing up. And you just tie it up. I think I'll cut a little bit off these ribbons, you see. A little long. So they do. So we'll just cut a little bit off. What length are they? And that is our card for the day. I can't remember what Dawn called it. It was a cute fun fold card that I got to use some of the images I had stamped on and use up some papers. So thank you for stopping by. These papers, I have no idea where any of them came from. They're all just papers in my stash. So they could be from anywhere. So sorry about that. But... Thank you so much for stopping by. It is much appreciated. Please give me a like, comment, subscribe, and listen to keep me going. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you're all safe and well. And until the next time, Jack out.